The Upper Kittitas Valley, this is where the Ellensburg's Blues were deposited when at one time a uh, ancient stream had flowed through Green Canyon. I will not be focusing my search on this area because it's all private property and unless you have permission to be into that area, it just will not be part of the search area. The Green Canyon, this is where the ancient stream flowed and um, it, now that stream does not flow through there anymore because of First Creek. But um, the elevation of this canyon is 3,100 feet. And I need to keep that in mind when I'm putting the parameters for my search area. The Columbia Basalts, this is the western edge of the Columbia Basalt flows in this area. Um, it's the darker gray areas that you see, and that will be outside the boundaries that I'll be looking at. I will not find any Ellensburg Blues in that area. First Creek is the f stream that eventually cut through the ancient stream to divert all the water coming from that area, and it cut off the supply of agates going into the upper valley. Now, in between all the pins that I have there, there's that circle. That will be my focus for my search area. This is above 3,100 feet. There's agates in here. I've been in here a few times. And there's some very nice geodes. But uh, everything from up above there on that hill in the back behind that last pin to everything in the center is where I would concentrate my search for an Ellensburg Blue. I have found nice agates in here before, and this is just an area that I really enjoy going into. Now over to the left of the last pin over there that says Tianaway Basalts, those mountains there have agates in them also, and that is part of the Tiana Way Basalts, but that there I will be doing a different video on that area.